Hello humans and pets. Today we are going to be eating food. We're gonna be eating food. Yes, I guess, I guess. <laughs> you're getting, you're getting, you're not even gonna say we're gonna eat macaroni or something. Nah, just food. It's food. We're eating food. We're not only we're eating food. food, we are eating the flaming hot Cheetos mac and cheese. We cook some here. So, uh, our last video, yeah, it, it is, it, it looks like if I drop this on my shirt, I'm gonna have a problem. And they, they aren't normally this red. They, they're just plain noodles. It's like the stuff you put on it. Yeah, no, yeah, it's regular noodles, and then you put on the cheese sauce, which looks just like the flaming hot Correct. cheese sauce. I don't know if it's gonna taste like it, because to smell it, it, it ha the macaroni really comes off. I'm gonna give you a napkin. Because... Well, it's like, it's the powder stuff. Right. It's like so, flaming hot powder. I don't know what it's gonna taste like, but it definitely looks like a flaming yes. hot Cheeto. You know what I mean? So, but it's, we, it's macaroni. We recently did one, and, and I don't know what. What when it's gonna when, actually yeah. gonna pop out, but uh, we did a we we did bold their and cheesy or creamy yeah or their regular bold and cheese and we actually liked it mm -hmm. and uh, we we had another flavor so I you know Ryan's like let's try the other one so I kind of wanted to try to I like flaming hot Cheetos better than uh, yeah. like the regular ones anyway so while this is still hot and uh, let's let's give it a try and see what you think yeah. Again, I think this is a new thing that just came out, these Cheeto brand. Uh, I did ask, and she only thought it was like 60 cents a box. So they're, they're comparable to the... Google uh, says 90 cents. Google says 90. says 90. I think she got it for 60 cents a box. So they're not like outrageously more expensive. Again, I'll wait and see what you say for her. And then I'll give you my opinion. It's good. It's good. Right, there you go. That, I guess it's, that's all you're getting is, is good. So, right off the bat, um, the flavor... We're going to have to move those. I, I'm trying to, in my head... There is a nice spice to it. It's very cheesy. It tastes like flaming hot. And does it have the full flame? I'm trying to think. I, I can't it's remember. It's in the background. I can't remember the last time I had a flaming hot Cheeto. Normally, when you eat mac and cheese, you don't expect spicy. Right. But it fits. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm going to write down my throat. <coughs> it has a nice spice to it. <laughs> Sorry, COVID's coming back, yeah. But they, uh, <clears throat> I'm, try I'm just trying to see if I can say, yep, definitely a Flamin' Hot Cheeto. The other ones had the Cheeto taste. You couldn't mistake that. I don't taste the cheese as much as the spice. See, I, I think it has a, it's actually, to me personally, because when I make my mac and cheese, <clears throat> I usually like throwing in a little hot sauce. This already has a hot sauce flavor. Like, you know, it already, you don't need that. Uh, they got super red though. Mm -hmm. And is it actually a, a decent spice? How is it for you? Because you don't need as hot as I do. But you can t definitely taste. Yeah, it's like a Fleming Hot Cheetah. Mm -hmm. It's pretty good. Now, me personally, I like this one better than the regular regular one because I like the spiciness of the flavor. Because again, I would have ate the regular one. I liked it, but I would have hit it. Like if I was eating, see, it's funny when I eat on camera like this because it's one of the few times in my life almost everything I have either has hot peppers, hot sauce. I make my own crushed red pepper. I put hot on almost every single thing I eat except for when I'm doing this so I can actually taste all the stuff. But... This one actually has a nice enough spice on it. Yeah. The the noodles I like. Mm -hmm. um, I think the taste of it is good. Now I'll go back to I really like the fact that they're using these little spiral noodles. Yeah. Uh, I I think you know every noodle. As a kid, I just thought every macaroni tastes the same, but there is a distinct difference when you get like a shell or an elbow or you know when the spirals are nice with this.
I do get the red hot taste. It, this is actually really well, good. It has the flaming hot taste mm -hmm. with like the, the noodles. It's pretty good. Mm -hmm. You know why? Because the noodle really change. It's not like a puff. You know, you get that yeah. macaroni taste. But when you just do, because again, when I make my mac and cheese, I usually like, leave, like it a little creamier. Mm -hmm. And when you eat just the sauce, mm -hmm. it is definitely a flaming hot. Oh, yeah. Definitely. It has it's, a lot of taste. Mm-hmm. I I like this more. I like this more. I think this is one of the better mac and cheeses mm -hmm. I've tasted, like out of the box. I'm wondering. Oh, stick your tongue out. No. Okay. I was wondering if, like, if 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 a kid ate it, like a little kid, would he end up being red? You know what I mean? Like I am a little kid. Right. That's why I said stick your tongue out to see if it was all over your face and stuff. But no. I didn't know if it was, I just wanted to know if it well, stained. It looks like it's going to stain bad. I mean, it's red. Mm -hmm. But overall, this this was delicious, actually. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty good. Well, Spicy, what? cheesy, and oh, so easy to love. There's no, there's no salty taste. Like like I said no, before. No, it's not salty. With the, with the regular, the regular one, some of them are good. I find we, we ended up like in, uh, in, maybe we can do a mac and cheese one. Well, we've already eaten them all, but all right. Like the Velveeta one to me is less salty and more cheesy flavor. The actual, like the, 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 the uh, store brand is actually, to me, the actual yeah. deluxe one has like a really salty taste sometimes. I like how they didn't falsely advertise it because it looks on the box that it's going to be fake. Like, no way mac and cheese is going to be bad. It was red. But it was the same color as this Yeah, was. No, it, it definitely, it, everything about it, honestly, for uh, 60 cents or whatever it comes out to. Yeah. Uh, this is a great alternative to, you know, when you bet like the other mac and cheese that oh, actually definitely. has the cheese. That I mean, that's that that's usually my, my when you buy the cheap one. With that, that you can get a couple for a buck, mm -hmm. and, and, and you know, it's just not as flavorful no, as when not. you use the cheese packets. And both of these Cheeto ones mm -hmm. were just as good as when you use the cheese packets because yeah. it had that Cheetos flavor. Oh, on yeah, it. and so I like Cheetos in general, but they're not the first choice of a snack. I think he wants to be famous. No, I don't think he wants to be famous, he wants a treat. But come here, bud. So, Come yeah, no, with, with that, honestly, this, this again is, is, it was excellent. I, I do, I, 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 I would eat, I, I, I hope they don't go away. I don't know if they're limited time. Yeah, I don't, I don't even know if they're is. new. I've never seen them in a the store. No, I've never And, uh, she happened to pick them up when we both were down with COVID and, uh, so that we get, you know, I think she got it around that time. So well, that, I think it was before, like way before. It would, yeah, we were, so, so we almost did it when we were when we when yeah, we had it. Yeah, yeah, when we were sick, yeah. we we were looking for some stuff, but I decided not to yeah. get better. And it, yeah, now just in case it, things got worse. And fixed, it, it, honestly, guess, while so. I had it, I I couldn't talk without going into a coffin fit, and that's why I just said that. Like it, <clears throat> every once in a while, I'll feel it in my throat, and I have to fight back that I'm gonna. Get go into a cough still, and it's been weeks now, and and I'm I'm beyond. Yep. You know, it just won't go away. But I wouldn't have been able to do the videos uh, then, yeah, anyway. So we we we've had them for a little while, but that definitely. Yeah, I mean, not even counting price, you but just for need sixty butter, yeah, uh, water and milk, yeah, you, yeah, and the box. Yeah, it's very simple to prepare. Yeah. You, you boil the macaroni until it's done. I want to buy the box, take the packet, and I'm putting mm. it on other stuff. I said this last time. Yeah, put it in the. Uh, the meat nuggets. <laughs> um, We're going to have to search long and far to try to find you some meat nuggets. I think it's a good see. idea. You know, <laughs> chicken nuggets and then you have like hamburg meatball nuggets. Yeah, it's called a meatball. Yeah, except they don't sell it anyway. Well, they sell meatballs. Where? Well, the place we wanted to go today. No fast food it, it, places. It, yeah. No, that people sell meatballs. Not like McDonald's. Yeah, like know. sub places have McDonald's sometimes. All right, we're going on, we're going off our subject again. We we're, we're back on a meat nugget somehow, but yeah, meat nuggets so, are good, and it would be better with this. Yeah, no, the the cheese sauce is actually good. I, I mean, Cheetos, I don't, is there a lot of sodium on this? Cheetos mm -hmm. needs to make meat it, nuggets. I, I never looked at a regular mac and cheese. I know, I mean, there's not, only um, mm -hmm. it's six hundred and <clears throat> ten um, megagrams. 
Or it's 730 megagrams for the whole thing. No, there you go. I, I, I don't know what's going on over there, man. But yeah, six for one serving, that's 2.5 servings per container. I could eat it all. But yeah, it, yeah, if you're going to eat whatever they recommend, it will be... Um, I didn't know if there was a lot of salt. Megagrams. But if you're going to eat a processed mac and cheese, this is one of the best uh, cheap boxes that I've ever had. As far as... Yeah. Uh, the flaming hot was nice. If you don't like flaming hot Cheetos, the bold mm -hmm. and spicy or whatever we ate last time was it tasted like like Cheetos when on Mac. It was actually and really it says good too. There's two grams of sugar and zero <clears throat> grams of added sugar. Yeah, usually anything that comes in a box isn't it? Healthy Eight grams of protein. But yeah. But with that, it, it it was good. I yeah. you know, I definitely I definitely So I don't know if megagrams is salty. But um it was good. Well, that being said, uh, I guess we can have a nice short review today. We yeah. have so many long ones, but this is the Cheetos <laughs> mac and cheese. Cheetos flaming, flaming hot, hot mac flavor. and cheese. And yeah, no, it, it, I mean it, it was definitely delicious. So if if you do like that flaming hot taste, it was definitely worth the. Uh, you know the, the ninety nine cents. Well, you know it's good as a side. You know what I mean. So I, I think I think it was definitely legitimate as far as uh, you know whether you know if you like uh, mac and cheese, mac and cheese as as something whether it be a side or a meal. So you know again, if you like this video, hit the like button. Uh, if you you know if not. You know, there's no dislike button. We're sorry about well, that. Leave is. a comment down below. There is a dislike button. Is there button. a dislike button? Don't hit that one. Yeah. And yeah. the like button instead. Yeah, hit the like button. Yeah. And again, any suggestions you have, uh, mm -hmm. again, we have a couple things, but, uh, you know, this was uh, convenient today, I guess. So this is the one we did. So. And it was delicious. It was good. And I've been wanting to try it, and we do have one they more. They need to put this on a Taco Bell beefy... Uh, they don't need to do it? anything to that. That was delicious on its own. That, that, well, that was right, but that would also be yeah. Good. No, it, you know, you know that one. That one to me was a home run. That that, that, that was the best dollar. You know what I mean? In fact, yeah. we, we should. I feel like they're gonna like make them a thing and then be like five bucks. Well, I'll be interested to see because those were really good. Really good. And for a dollar, you couldn't beat them. Hey, it's you know? impossible. And so if they make them a real item, uh, I think I think they'll be a hit for them. I really do. Yeah, yeah, I like their potatoes, so, but that was really good. That was definitely good. But this also, I mean, the reviews for the Cheetos, and this was, out of the two of them, me personally, I like the spice. Yes. So I like the flame and hot But if better. you just want a Cheetos taste, then get, or just a mac and cheese traditional taste. I'll go back. The, the Cheetos mac and cheese, the bold and spicy or whatever we had last time, was better than, like, just regular crap macaroni and cheese because you had yeah, that Cheetos flavor. Yeah, so I would but eat it, that That's more of a mac and cheese, and this is a spicy noodle. This was really good. I guess. You, so. you know, I... It had that mm -hmm. that nice flame and hot taste. It wasn't so. too spicy, but it tasted really good. Yeah, oh, but if you eat flaming hot Cheetos and think yeah. they're spicy, then you would think this was spicy because oh, yeah, it right. had a nice, it had the mm -hmm. same heat. So, all right, I guess, I guess that'll be our video then on uh, the flaming hot Cheetos mac and cheese. And uh, you know, again, you know, any suggestions, any comments, leave them down below. Mm -hmm. And uh, you know, hope you enjoyed the video.